Pen with the feet, so let's get into this tea. We're about to get into um It is what it is. This is Mace and Cameron's show. To be honest, I don't even know if this is a copyright, but I'm gonna just we're gonna get into it however we need to. But basically, Kendrick Lamar was announced to be the um headline of 2025 Super Bowl, you know, for the halftime. And everybody mad it ain't Lil Wayne, including Lil Wayne, Nicki Minaj, Boo, um, Birdman, everybody. So let's get into it. I, and listen, I love Kendrick Lamar. I love the pop up. I think he's one of the top artists of this generation, period. Hate this election. It's in New Orleans. You don't get Lil Wayne. You That's what we doing? Yeah. Listen, yeah. you don't get Lil Wayne in New Orleans for the Hot Super Bowl. Not just Hot Boys, Cash Money, all the songs Lil Wayne's done, whether it's Blink-182, there's no reason why Lil Wayne should not be performing the Super Bowl. There's no reason. There's one person who's stopping this. I know, you know, it's not really, it's not really a secret. Lil Wayne had a problem with somebody before who's kind of part of the organization running it. This is payback. Who's that? Who's Lil Wayne artist? Drake. Yeah, this, not, this is this hating is, at this, this age is it, crazy. It's crazy, yeah. bro. It, you know them niggas still probably don't like Jay Z either. Jay Z made the final decision that panel stuff is BS. Yeah, for everybody to be saying that Jay Z is the one who made the decision, it got to be true. It got to be true. So, like, that's childish as hell. I'm not gonna lie. I would have gave Lil Wayne that. I don't know what beef they got though, but. I would have gave Lil Wayne that. Granted, what's popping this year is Kendrick Lamar. I get it, but I wouldn't have brought him to New Orleans for that. <laughs> I wouldn't have. If that's the case, they should have changed the city too. I mean, hell, well, I was going to say the Olympics is about to be there. That's in four years, but I'm just saying. What? Okay. What? Where was the Super Bowl at last year, y'all? I forgot. Bro, Bro, it's ridiculous. Like, Mike, Mike, this Mike, there's some hip hop shit that you probably don't know what's going on, to be totally honest with you. Yeah. So, we'll school you behind the scenes. Little Wayne, no, not to be performing in New Orleans for the Super Bowl, is egregious and it gotta stop. I can do that. It, it gotta stop. Mike Bills will tell you what's going on later. It gotta stop, bro. It gotta stop, man. Yeah, and I'm it, doubling down on that. Me. Hating at this age is crazy. Yeah, yeah. it's wild. I love Lil Wayne. Both it's wild, wild bro. Man. I work and, for and, Lil Wayne. I love him. I'm like, who is that who keep I love Lil Wayne great to death? Great and no, great and this has dude, nothing man. towards Kendrick. Kendrick. If anybody deserved it, Kendrick deserved yeah. it. But there's some right, backstory right, shit you. going on Yeah. while Lil Wayne is not performing the Super Bowl. All right, good points. right. I can dig it. Yeah, that's sad. That's that's so that's so sad. Yeah, that's like really sad. Like <laughs> for real, bro. You are that insecure, man? Like, come on, it's crazy. And then what was their fallout? Like, what did they fall out over? What what was what made it so bad to the point where now you like? I'm gonna just take that grand moment away from him. You know what I'm saying? Um, and what's even more messed up is Jay-Z not even going to respond. It's crazy. Me he might. Was he put out a song. Supposed to be a fanatics. Same thing Three, we, three weeks ago, the, the week before fanatics happens, oh, Cam and Mace didn't sign the contract. <laughs> we banned from fanatics, but <laughs> who's in fanatics? <laughs> I'm going to start saying names. <laughs> Yo, it's wild, man. It's wild. <laughs> the hate bro. is crazy. Yeah. Yeah. We'll, yeah, tell, you, right, we'll tell you about it we, later, we, Mike. Mike, we'll tell you we, about we it later. We got to get bigger, though. Yeah, you're man. Right, though. We you right, we're right. So we, we'll hold on to stuff, man. And, and, and when we come together and get things done much bigger and better, mm -hmm. you're right. Yeah. Oh, we'll Carter hold versus Carter for a minute. So, right. so I'm with you on that. Yeah. yeah. But no, this has none against Kendrick Lamar. Yeah, none against yeah. Kendrick. He, we, yeah, we think if you any kind of artist deserve it, but Lil Wayne not to perform in New Orleans at the Super Bowl, it's kind of tough, man. Yeah, and I just said hi, boys, because everybody's out, you know? BG yeah. out, you know? But, you, but what I'm saying is you, you said everything right, but Lil Wayne's such a star. He could, you know how many songs he's done with other people, and then you bring the hot boys out at yeah. the end? Yeah. 
crazy, <laughs> crazy. Well, I can't speak on the other things, but I will add, I do think Kendrick will make it right because it is only right for Lil Wayne to be there. If, you know, things... Man, Lil Wayne ain't about to come as no sidebar. He might. I hope he don't. I hope he don't. No. No, 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 no. I hope he don't. Um, I don't know if the uh, artist has full, like, ownership of that either. Uh, like, they have a lot of rules. And do y'all know they don't even get paid for half times? They don't even get paid. They get a budget to spend. They don't even get paid. So, man, it's so much to the Super Bowl and the football in general. I just, it just don't sit right with me. But ain't nothing you can run away from. It is what it is. So anyway, Nicki Minaj is highly upset about this whole debacle going on right now. And she has some things to get off her chest yesterday on uh, Twitter. I, ain't, I don't know if I ever call it X because X. Anyway, she says denying a young black man uh, what he rightfully put into this game for no other reason but your ego, your hatred for Birdman and Drake and Nicki got you punishing Lil Wayne. Lil Wayne, the GOAT? No, yeah. What's good? Um, Eminem stood firm on having 50 Cent come out. A white man, shit sad. Um, house Igor tings, but it's good. It's good for them. Uh, no loyalty. Well, then niggas will keep sunning you. Um, and then she's hashtagging DTLR Gag City DC. LMAO, good as for Del Gal. You are good as for them. I don't know what that means, <laughs> but next. Master P spoke on the situation with Kendrick Lamar upcoming Super Bowl halftime performance. Says Lil Wayne should be a part of this celebration as well. And <laughs> for him to say that, that's, that's on some like mature, older man shit. Um, he said, confused. Oh, I don't know who Fabian Fabian is. Oh, Lil Wayne's longtime engineer seemingly reacts to the Kendrick Lamar halftime news. Confused, disappointed, angry, but most of all inspired. Will never again be in a position or have the GOAT in a position where we are at mercy of someone else's decision. We will make the decisions. And what they basically saying is, nigga, create your own Super Bowl. Become the boss over it. And I, I completely agree. Like, the way I feel about these awards and things, like, some of these... um celebrities really crash out when they don't get awards. And honestly, when you find out who is actually giving out the awards, it really changes the whole magnitude of the award because like it changes the energy on it because the people who's really granting it, they ain't for us. <laughs> it's the best way I can say it. It's the best way I can say it, man, you got to learn to uh, reward yourself like literally so y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below i just um Lil wayne absolutely should have received that i will say too though um Lil wayne probably need to create his own thing which he already has though like i forgot what it's called like the Lil wayne bash something he do every year um you know he, he already kind of got a thing but you know y'all know what i mean create something that he can call his own. Um, and Eminem absolutely uh, brought out the people he was supposed to bring out, but Lil Wayne, one of them that need to headline. Yeah, the Wheezy Fest. Lil Wayne, one of them that just kind of need to headline. Um, no disrespect to Kendrick Lamar, but I mean, hell. Lil Wayne co-lining, co-signing, whatever, to Kendrick Lamar. And I'm not saying Kendrick Lamar ain't that. I'm just saying Lil Wayne is really him. But y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, yeah.